Testing. Okay, hello students. Uh, today we're going to have a history lesson. Okay, so I'm sorry. Uh, I'm a little bit late. It is because due to uh some technical problem. Okay, I have to fix it first. So therefore, uh, yes, we are going to start a little bit uh about late. Okay, so before we start, before we start, okay, so uh, please prepare, please prepare everything, including your textbook, okay, including your textbook. Okay, and also, and also, um, your computer. So, uh, besides you're watching this video, okay, and right now, uh, I want you to... Uh, move to like your Google Classroom, okay. Google Classroom page, okay. I I would like to show you something, okay. Like this, okay. So for example, the, if it is just like one a, one a, okay. Uh, someone left a message. Okay, one a, okay. Like this like this okay so that would be your attendance to date so uh, you're going to take your attendance you're going to take your attendance okay so uh, what would be like the attendance uh, that would be uh, right now I'm going to tell you the magic word magic word okay and uh, I will tell you two magic words uh, during the whole lessons okay and you have to fill it in okay and that would be for your attendance okay so please pay attention everyone so the first magic word okay the first magic word that would be the pangs okay the pangs the pangs okay here okay so please note okay the pangs that would be the first magic word and then uh, i will tell you the second magic word okay so at uh, later Okay, so therefore, uh, I think so. Almost, almost a lot of students. Okay, you're ready. Okay, so let's start our lesson. Let's start our lesson. Okay, so today we're going to continue our study on like the rural life of Hong Kong. Okay, the rural life of Hong Kong. So today that will be part three. Uh, before we have already, uh, Mr. Liu have already introduced like uh, what were the uh, life in the uh, prehistoric time and historic time in Hong Kong, and also last time uh, I talk about like the four major uh, four major dialect groups in Hong Kong. Okay. And uh, also I talk about. Uh, I talk about uh, the history, okay, history uh, during like the Qing Dynasty to the Qing Dynasty, okay. Yes, stop, stop discussing. Yes, the plans, P A N G S, okay. So I will talk about uh, what, what are those group of people, okay. Okay, uh, last time we talked about like the uh, history in Hong Kong. So therefore, um, what are we going to talk about today? Okay, like this. So in my background picture here. Okay. So, uh, what is it? It is an ancestral hall. Ancestral hall. Ancestral hall in Chinese we may call it uh qi tong la. Okay, qi tong. So uh what would be like the ancestral hall? Uh I would say it, most clan okay most clan they would have their own ancestral hall. For example, I have my ancestral hall. Okay. So you may you may also like have your own ancestral hall then where would be your or my ancestral hall 
so that would be in of course in my hometown okay in your hometown so where is your hometown i don't know okay and where is my hometown that would be in hong kong in the north district so i know exactly okay where is my ancestral hall so i know exactly okay where is the home place so therefore today today i'm going to introduce okay if you refer to your textbook if you refer to your textbook so as we need to yes stop talking about anything that is totally unrelated okay so i have to remove your chat first okay so we're going to talk about this so the five great clans okay five great clans of the new territories okay so first first you have to highlight the five great clans of the new territories in chinese we can call it uh, 中国, um, uh, 香港新界, okay so who are those five great clans or what are they okay a clan a clan is a large group of families that have the same ancestor and surname. So what is in Chinese like a clan? Clan in Chinese we may call it uh Okay? So they have the same ancestor, same surname, Okay. For example, last time we talked about like the four major uh, dialect groups in Hong Kong. The Puntis, Hakkers, uh, Foklos and also uh, Tankers, Tankers, okay? So I would say for each clan, for each clan, they would have their own surname, especially like for the Punti. So the Punti were the earliest dialect group settled in the new territories. So here, here, that would be the five clans, the Tangs, the House, the Pans, the Lius, and also the Mans were the most powerful Punti clans. Sun Gai okay, the Tangs, Dangsi la, the House, Hao Si. The pangs, pang si ya, okay, sing pang or the the pangs, uh, the leaves, liu si la, and also the men's man si. So these five clans, these five family, okay, so were the most powerful punti clans. And also they were the earliest settler and played uh, in the new territories and played an important role in the early development of Hong Kong. Okay? So that's why we may regard them as the five great clans of the new territories. So therefore, therefore here who are they okay so the five families okay so let's continue so why were they so powerful in the new territories so just now we use the word like powerful but uh why that would be the what we call powerful okay uh yes i know that i know that uh okay so uh, i received your message okay so uh actually i know this problem so this is uh related to a technical problem okay about uh our school email account and youtube sometimes sometimes for me okay i use my own account to uh, watch some video uh, it is mentioned that it said it is restricted so therefore uh, i may need to switch the switch the account or somehow i need to lock it off okay so if you if you uh, encounter some problem like this okay so you may ask your classmate it is because some some of them okay so they have to no problem 
Okay, so let's continue. So why those five families? Okay, ah, one more time if you are late. Okay, so uh, I may tell you the first magic word. Okay, don't miss the first magic word. The first magic word that will be the third one, the pangs. Okay, pangs la. So that will be the first magic word, and I will tell you the second magic word later. Why were they so powerful? Okay, in the new territories. So let's have a look about the paragraph. Okay, first, first, those five Greek clan actually they settled in the new territory since the Song Dynasty and Ming Dynasty. Okay, let's have a look. They had great economic power. 佢哋有一个好强大嘅一个经济实力。Okay, why? Why? It is because you may write it down. It is because as they settled in the uh in the new territories, or they settled in Hong Kong at the early time. Therefore, therefore, those uh punti, okay, those group of people actually they can settled on some fat land. First, some fat land first, okay, and then last time I have mentioned. So what would be the function? What would be uh like the importance of fat land? So that would be for farming. For example, for example, okay. So who own the uh largest fat land like in Hong Kong in the past? That would be the tanks, the tanks. 鄧氏啦，啊佢哋喺全全香港最靚嗰個嘅平地係去到誒、呃、聚居，邊度最靚平地啊？元朗一帶咯。So therefore they can carry out farming, and when they can carry out farming, it means it means they can have higher income, higher income. Okay, so therefore here it mentioned as they own a lot of land here, it mentioned that actually they can farm, they can have lot of farmland. Okay, so why they have lot of land then they can uh generate higher income? It is because <coughs> first, if they had uh if they owned lots of land, it means that they can Carry out the farming by themselves. By themselves, that would be the first point. The second point that is, they can rent the land to other for farming. So that's why they can, they can generate high income. Ah, they have five day. They they may be can need to be able 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 收入，咁因此點解佢哋會有一個 great economic power？ Okay， as they settle in Hong Kong early， so therefore they can have more fat land than higher income， so therefore great economic power。So that would be the first one。So， uh， the first point， that's why great economic power， and also those group of people， they would also set up markets。Set up market. They will be going to set up some kind of markets in Chinese in this term. Okay, in this uh topic, we call it "hui shi." Okay, "hui hui shi." "Hui shi." Okay, actually, uh, we will talk about it later. Okay, for "hui shi." So it means like the market. So therefore, people can uh. Do the trading here, so again, it can help to uh boost the economic development. Okay, so therefore, therefore, uh, since they have they have higher or greater economic power, then if you look at your textbook, the next sentence you can see their descendants got scholarly titles. Scholarly titles in Chinese we can call it, uh, 一啲嘅功名，誒喺一個科舉考試，喺一啲嘅公開考試
考取成績攞到嘅功名 scholarly title。So why their descendants they can get scholarly title? It is because normally after those、uh, clan as they have greater economic power, okay, as they、uh, have more income, therefore they would build, they would build. They will start to build this study hall. You may understand it as like school, okay? 佢哋會起多一啲嘅學校。So therefore, the descendant, their children, they can attend to the study hall to study. So therefore, they can attend the examination. Then, then, they may get the scholarly title. So what would be the importance of the scholarly title? Ah,、uh, 考取功名有乜嘢用咧 ？Okay, so I would say that is relatively important in the in the past. Okay, as if they can have the scholarly title, they can be the officials in the government. 佢哋考取功名之后就可以做官啦。做官之后 ，Okay, you can see this can further enhance their influence. 佢哋嘅影響力就會進一步係去到提升。So therefore, let's have a look. Okay. So here that would be like the stories. Okay, of the five great clans. Okay. So don't worry. Okay, you're not you're not going to memorize this. Uh, the detail of these five families. So you will just um have it for a reference. Okay. For example, especially Like the tanks, okay? 我哋講鄧氏啦，鄧氏啦。So you can see the remarks of tanks, okay? Tang Fu Hip, so one of a very important ancestor of the tanks. 一個鄧富協啦。He was a Jin Shi, okay? Jin Shi in Chinese we call it Jun Shi. 進士咩叫進士咧 ？So that is one of the scholarly title in the 誒、uh, public exam in in the past。以前誒喺成個科舉考試入邊，咁誒、呃、當然我哋未會係去到講去到考到狀元嗰啲啦。但係喺一啲嘅鄉試或者殿試啦，誒、呃、上到去皇帝嗰啲誒情況之下。你一定要好好成績嗰啲咧，咁佢會係一個進士嚟嘅，係啦。咁誒、呃、詳細嗰、那個誒、呃、詳細嗰、那個誒、呃、考試我就唔係好記得㗎啦。咁呢個可能之後先至再揾翻俾你去到睇。但係總之咧，一個好成績，咁要考到好後咧，咁就會係啲高中進士啦。得唔得？跟住佢哋之後先至啊，再喺誒、呃、皇帝之前，即係考一個殿試啊，跟住先至再分排名，跟住先至再分誒誒、呃、狀元啊、探花榜眼等等等等嘅，係啦。但係誒喺以前已經會有誒、呃、一啲元朗嘅鄧氏啊考獲進士 ，OK。And also you can also see like for the house, for the house, OK。So also So one of it, Hao Nong, okay, was a Jin Shi during the North Di- North Song Dynasty, and for the Pangs, for the Pangs, you can see the ancestor, Pang Yin Nin, okay, was a Jin Shi and an official, an official, okay, and、uh, for the Liu's, okay, so Liu Kong and、uh, his fourth son were important official during the North Song Dynasty. And for the men, and also you can see, okay, so also the official. So therefore, you can see that like for the five great clans, for the five family, okay, you can see that you can see that, uh, they can have a very very great influence. Okay, so uh, I can see someone who keep. Who keep talk about rubbish in the live chat? Uh, I have to warn you that. 而家警告你哋啊，我哋呢個係個上堂嘅時間。
係一個上堂嘅時間。你唔好係去到騷擾其他人，呢度唔係俾你玩嘅，清唔清楚？呢、這個 live chat 係俾你問問題嘅。系俾你問問題，係向 Mister 問問題噶。你哋唔好攞呢度嚟玩得唔得啊？ Okay, so therefore that would be about some basic information of the five Greek clans. If you want to know more, if you want to know more detailed, so actually, actually,、uh, I have already prepared a video for you. But I'm not going to show you the video. It is because that is due to some copyright issue. Okay, due to some copyright issue. So therefore, uh, I cannot show you the video. Okay, at the live time streaming. Okay, this one that would be the video. Okay. Talk about uh to describe the five great clans and also uh to introduce what would be the life of the people in the rural village. Okay, this one. Okay, you may have a look by yourself. Okay, so therefore after this, after this, ah, what more I have to talk about? So this is also important. You may mark a star here. So where? Where uh did the five great clans settled? Okay, where did the five great clans settled? Okay, uh let's have a look. For example, like for the tanks in Yunlong, mainly in Yunlong, and also Camtin, Fanling, and Taipo, and for the house, Shengshui, Shengshui, for the tanks, Fanling, and for the leaves, Shengshui, and also for the men's, Taipo. Typo. So therefore, if you have a look for the for the next page, okay. So what would be the meaning of this uh page or of this map? You can see that. So that would be the map of Hong Kong and okay. So the brown area here, the brown area that would be the land over one hundred meters. It means that would be like a hill, like a hill, okay. So hill that is not really good for farming, then then you can see that where did these five families settled? For example, just now I've mentioned, okay, like the tanks, Deng Xila in Yunlong, where would be like this? So here and here and also Camtin, okay, so that would be for the tanks. Deng Xi 就喺元朗一带啦，一个比较最大嘅平原。Okay, and also the house and also the leaves. Okay, house lah. Okay, here. So what would be the place here? Okay, you can have a look. House, how cool shack and such show hall in Hall Shang Hung. Okay, 呢個就係侯氏佢哋 settle 嘅地方，叫做何上鄉。何上鄉啦。I'm not sure you have heard uh about this place. 有冇聽過朗園濕地啊 ？Okay, actually, 朗園濕地 ，so that would be at the place of 河上鄉。It is also like a fat land. Okay, so that would be good for farming. Okay, and also the pangs and the leaves. Okay, so this one, the first one, that would be the leaves. And this one that would be the pangs. Okay, so leaves that would be in shang shui. Shang shui lah. Pangs, fan ling. Leaves 就喺上水啦。咁 Miss Tilio 咁就係誒廖氏嘅。咁我嘅 home town 啦，就係上水啦。棚氏 ，OK， 就會係誒粉嶺嘅啦。Okay, and also the men's, the men's you will see in Thai pole, and also here, here, San Tien, San Tien 啦，就係誒近落馬洲嘅一大啦，文氏。咁嗰度咧會有一個好出名嘅地方嘅，就叫做大夫地
，咁就係一啲民事佢哋嗰個嘅 study hall 嚟嘅。OK， 咁嗰度亦都會有一個誒、呃、文天祥紀念公園嘅，誒、呃、喺新田嗰度。咁如果你哋有興趣呢，誒、呃、假期假期啦，咁而家唔好出去住啦。咁遲啲疫情好返啲，假期呢，咁你哋亦都可以去新田嗰邊去到參觀一下嘅。係啦，不過誒，咁、呃、就順便參觀埋大夫弟啦。嗰、那個誒、呃、紀念公園呢，基本上就好簡單嘅啫。So therefore, that is where these five great clans uh they settled, and you will see, okay, in the Kowloon Peninsula and also Hong Kong Island, okay, no, okay, no, plenty they will settle here. Why? It is because uh there will be no fat land, okay, there will be no fat land. So uh later, so uh for the people who settled like in Hong Kong, such as like the Hakka, okay, 好似客家人咁啦。So they can only settle near the hillside and、uh, not much flatland for them. So therefore, that would be about the five great, five great clans, okay, in the、uh, new territories. And you will see, okay, you will see. Each of them, each of them, they would have their own ancestral hall. For example, like your house here, and here that would be. The Liu's, okay, in Shangshui, the with ancestral hall, the Pang ancestral hall in Fanling, the Man ancestral hall in Shantian, Munsi, 一樣啦，新田嗰度啦，頭先我講過元朗啦 ，and also, and also, uh, for the Tang ancestral hall in Ping Shan, Ping Shan, Ping Shan 啊。平山 ，if you study、uh, geography, okay, so you will also learn this historic tri-、uh, uh, heritage trial 嗰個誒平山文物徑啦 ，so that would be the same 平山，平山啦 ，okay, so that would be in Yunnan. So therefore, uh, I, uh, at the beginning, I have asked, uh, do you know your own Uh, do do you have your own ancestral hall? Uh, I would say you you may not know. Okay, it is because you may not know where would be your hometown. So where would be the、uh, hometown of your family? Okay, of your father's family. Okay, especially your father's family. So, uh, 成日會講啊，啊，咪會問，咦，你哋知唔知道自己嘅祖籍喺邊度咧？係啦。你自己嗰個姓氏，你哋嗰個宗親，你哋會唔會有自己嘅祠堂咧 ？So、uh, I would say like for Mr. Liu, okay? So I know exactly where would be my birthplace, where would be my hometown. So that would be in Shangshui, okay? It is because so my family has been settled in Shangshui for few hundred years already, okay? So therefore, therefore. Uh, if you do not know, okay. Okay, but Song went to Hong. Why they went to Hong Kong in? So I, I don't understand your, I don't understand your questions. So you means. You means, but the means, okay. You, You means here? You means here? Went to Hong Kong. Wang Yilam, uh, the, do do you mean you talking about this? You talk about this. So actually, uh, that would be. That would be uh. Remember, we we do not. We do not focus on the exact number, okay? We focus on the exact number. So, uh, just now we we mentioned that, ah,、uh, yes, the Song Dynasty and 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 then why the men, uh, went to Hong Kong. So that would be during the Yuan Dynasty, okay? During the Yuan Dynasty, during the Yuan Dynasty. So, uh, many people, or especially during the War Period. Especially during the war period, okay, and the people they need to escape in the mainland China. They need to escape, uh, in the mainland China. So therefore, uh, you may say that is 
almost the end at the period remember that is not a uh, exact year that is at the period so that is at the end of uh, the song dynasty or the yun dynasty so that is between like the war period so that's why the people moved so remember we do not do not focus on the exact year or then we talk about one year 年份啊，誒嗰班人誒喺邊一年咁樣嚟到，咁我哋就唔會咁講嘅，我哋會講啊係一個時期咁樣嚟到嘅，得唔得 ？OK， so therefore that's why that's why 誒、uh, here， so when they first settle， that is around， OK， around。If you mention like the all these five， 誒、uh, families， that is around this period， OK， so that is at the century， OK。Okay, so therefore, uh, here let me show you some extra information. Just now, Miss Tilly said that I know exactly where would be my, uh, ancestral hall. Okay, let me show you my ancestral hall. Okay, so we move to the browser. Okay, we go to the Google Map. Okay, sorry, I need to hide the chat first. So we move to the Google Map. Okay, sorry, this is in mainland China, and we go back to Hong Kong. Okay, here. So that would be Hong Kong. So I hope you can see that. Okay, so let's go to the new territories. Okay, you can see here. Okay, here that would be in Yunlong and Kamtin, and there that would be a Fanling and Shengshui. Okay, then if we move to Shengshui. Shang Shui and Fan Ling. Okay, I I'm not sure you can watch the area clearly. Okay, so this is Fan Ling. This is Fan Ling, and there is Shang Shui. Okay, let me show you the village. Okay, I have been living. Okay, in my life, that would be here. So that would be the village of the Liu's. This one is the Liu's. 喺上水嘅圍村啦，圍村啦 ，OK。So therefore you can see right now there's lot still lot of uh village house, OK. And you can see some forest, uh not exactly forest, uh some woodland, OK. Some woodland, some woodland, OK. They call it a uh 风水林啦，风水林。Okay, so the woodland, and okay, let me show you. So where would be the ancestral hall of my family? Okay, it should be ah yes, this one. Okay, if we move to the street view, okay, if we move to street view, okay, you can see one of the ancestral hall. So this one, ah,、uh, this is not mentioned in your textbook, okay. Uh, it is because that is not the greatest, greatest、uh, ancestral hall for the Liu's. So that is one of the ancestral hall. However, this is not the、uh, ancestral hall of my family. Okay. If you turn around, you can see another right here. You can see another like this. Okay, like this. I may tell you this is the ancestral hall. This is the ancestral of my family. 會有佢哋自己嘅一個祠堂嘅。咁所以咧，如果 Miss Tilly 嚟計咧，咁呢個咧就係我個家族，我個家族，我個誒、呃、其中一個分支啦。咁就係呢個就係我個祠堂嚟噶啦。OK， and I may tell you. So, uh, when I was young, okay, when I was young, so many many years ago. So actually, Miss Tilly study the kindergarten. In this ancestral hall, okay, 我係喺祠堂嗰度讀幼稚園嘅。So just now I've mentioned that, especially for the five great clans, as they have the、uh, greater economic power, they can set up、uh, the study hall, they can set up school. So therefore,、uh, I may tell you, okay, I studied kindergarten, okay, in the ancestral hall, exactly this one, okay, exactly this one. So in the past, that would be the kindergarten. So therefore,、uh, you can see that. So that would be about some. That would be about some、uh, scenes, okay, in the war village, and also I may show you so one of 
another ancestral hall. If I remember correct, okay, it would be here. Ah, yes, here. Let me show you some thing inside the ancestral hall. Okay, like this. That would be the inside the ancestral hall. So you can see that you can see that actually uh, the layout of the ancestral hall of this one and also for that one that would be similar. Okay, you can see a lot of plate here, lot of plate here, and also in the main hall you can see the soap tablet. Soap tablet. Uh, this one we may call it it is a Pai la. Okay, so uh, today I don't think I have enough time to talk about like the ancestral hall, but uh, I would like to mention that would be very very important first, very important first. That would be uh, remember ancestral hall, qi tong. Okay, remember ancestral hall that is not equal to uh, a temple. Qi tong Qi Tong and Setsu Ho, that would be for the whole family. Okay, so that is for the uh, clan. It's a place of a place. But what is the temple? The temple is a place of a Qi Tong and the temple are two things. So remember. And therefore, you can see that uh, like in a temple, what is the temple? The temple is a place of a place of a place. Okay, some uh, religious statues. And then, so what do you say? Okay, and in ancestral hall, remember, you can see that would be the soap tablet. That would be the clan's ancestor. 記住,在祠堂裏面是有神主牌,就是他們的祖先,他們的先人的神主牌,就不會有任何,不會有任何跟宗教有關,不會有一些神明,有一些神像在那裡,這個你們要搞清楚,祠堂和廟宇是兩
誒喺嗰段時間誒喺、呃、當地喺新界住嘅居民，佢哋有咩誒、呃、反應呢？就係、是、當英國人、呃、去到租借新界之後咧，咁其實佢哋會覺得係英國人佔領咗佢哋嘅家園，佔領咗佢哋嘅土地。咁所以咧喺誒一八九八年開始咧，咁就有好多好多、呃喺新界嘅鄉民就係去到反抗，係向 you can see that so the villagers begin their resistance against resistance against the British。佢哋就向英國人反抗，咁係一個武裝嘅反抗，佢哋會用埋啲大炮啊，咁用武力係向英國人去到反抗嘅，但係當然最尾咁就梗係失敗啦。咁喺呢個成個反抗嘅過程當中咧，咁就係、是呃、大部分嘅新界嘅居民或者新界嘅鄉親咧，咁係去到做嘅。咁喺呢個反喺成個反抗嘅時期咧 ，you can see that the tanks, the house, the pens, the lives and also the men who lead the resistance had a lot of land and great influence. So therefore, the British call them five great clans. 咁因為喺呢個反抗期間，呢五大嘅聖族，咁佢哋佢哋嗰個、呃、影響力比較大啦，咁所以就會之後叫咗佢哋做、呃、五大聖啦。咁所以呢，呃、我要話俾你聽，除咗喺新界，除咗呢五大聖，仲有冇其他嘅、呃、香港嘅本地嘅 p o n t i s 本地嘅原居民呢？我同你講係有嘅。好多地方都有香港嘅原居民，例如誒喺、呃、大埔啦，大埔亦都會有啲原居民姓陳啦，喺西貢啦有啲原居民姓黃啦、姓張啦，咁都會係有嘅。咁唔淨係單單指呢五個家族啦，或者呢五個地方。咁其實咧，香港都仲有好多地方咧。都會係有佢哋嘅祠堂，有佢哋嘅原居民，只不過係喺誒呢一個嘅反抗喺呢個 resistance 嗰度。OK， so these five families， these five families pay a relatively great contribution， so therefore， 誒、uh, they would be regarded as the five great clans of the new territories。It doesn't mean that there will be only five families。OK。Uh, in the new territories,、uh, I may also tell you,、uh, such as like in some place that would be very famous, that would be very famous. For example, like near Cam Tien, 好似錦田嗰度啦，誒唔知你哋有冇聽過啦？錦田一帶咁嗰度都有好多圍村嘅，咁例如有誒、呃、八鄉啊、十八鄉啊，咁一樣啦，會有好多嘅誒、呃、農地啦，或者有呢啲嘅原居民嘅，得唔得？咁所以咧，記住就誒唔好諗住，咦誒、呃、自己咦唔係呢五個姓嘅喎、哦，咁即係咪有機會唔誒、呃、即係可能誒屋企人啊爸爸媽媽啊話，咦唔係喎，你係原居民嚟嘅喎，香港原居民嚟喎，但係你又唔係呢個姓喎、哦，咁點解咧？咁因為其實香港嘅原居民咧都有好多嘅，都有好多嘅，咁所以咧就誒。呃記住，唔係淨係得呢五個，仲有其他，咁都可以係原居民，都可以係香港嘅 pointers 嚟嘅，得唔得 ？OK， so therefore， 誒、uh, ，that would be about the five great clans， and then， 誒、uh, ，later here， that would be about the life in the traditional rural Hong Kong。咁呢度咧就會有誒、呃，下一次啦，下一次講啦，下一次講就係、是。咦，咁喺個圍村生活，咁有啲生活會點咧 ？OK， so next time Miss Tilly will talk about this. OK， so the rural life, and also I will talk about like the ancestral hall. And OK， so uh in the video, in this video, actually uh I have already ah yes, what will be the second magic word? So I almost forget. So as we cannot finish this, so uh I may tell you. So what will be the second magic word? Ah, I've almost forget. So the second magic word, okay. So that would be, okay. The second magic word, the fifth one, pirate. Pirate, okay. The second magic word, pirate. So I'm sorry, I almost forget. Okay, I almost forget. I 爭啲唔記得咗嘅 The second magic word, pirate. 
pirate. Okay, so uh, if you know the first metric word and the second metric word, so please uh, enter it and submit it, it, it will be all right. Okay, so the first one, the pangs, the second one, pirate. We haven't a pirate. Okay, British not leads Hong Kong Island. Oh, no, 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 no. So, uh, uh, Hong Kong do get uh, Hong Kong don't my Joe Jag. Hong Kong do the Hayapat Okay, after uh, during one eighteen, uh, that is during eighteen thirty nine, thirty nine. Okay, Yapat Sam Gaulin, get Apin Zinzang. Okay, so uh, the first Sino British war. Okay, uh, or you may say like the Opium War. Okay, Opium War, Arpin Jin Zhang. Gumjahai, said the tanks, not the pangs. Really? Okay, let me check. Don't worry, uh, you may submit this also. I will amend the answer. Okay, I can amend the answer. Ah yes, that would be the tanks. Ah, I thought that would be the banks. Ah, I'm sorry, I do it wrong. Yeah, okay, 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 Yingok,跟住之後清政府再同英國打多第二次戰爭,跟住就割讓埋九龍半島的。香港島啦,連同九龍半島啦,連同新界啦,就一次個歸還翻俾中國嘅。得唔得? so therefore remember to enter enter the attendance for the metric word, okay? And then, okay, so that's all for today. So time is almost up. Again, if you have any questions, okay, try to uh, ask me in the email and also uh, in your live chat. So I said that, okay, I enter, I input it wrong, okay, I will mark it. Okay, don't worry. I will change this, okay? Don't worry, I will let you in. Oh, and then, okay, so, ah, yes, next week, next week, okay, so uh, I will also carry out the uh, live stream. So, therefore, please pay attention, okay, so to the Google Classroom and uh, pay attention to the announcement, pay attention to the email, and then, okay, let's see if we have anything to do, okay. So, uh, remember to have your uh, enter the attendance, okay. And then, okay, so uh, I will see you next week, okay? Next week, we're going to talk about what, like, what will be the life in the uh, rural village. Okay, so then that's all for today, and goodbye, cars, okay?